So, brother, remind me again why we have to get involved in this war. If we don't fight, the war will spread to our lands. To keep our people safe, we have to destroy the conflict at its root! But there's more to it than that! We're helping out the Imperial Army here. And the palace will soon realize just what we can do. Isn't that right, Father? I have no need for glory. All I wish to do is stamp out the sparks of conflict. Nothing more. I am not frightened of a little fire! You... you hide your face. Because you brought... you brought conflict to the land. That is all. <laughs> Simple and animalistic. You really are a tiger. Uh, but... those... fangs... Will draw more enemies. <laughs> Father, what is it? It's nothing. Come, let's go home. to challenge me over here I'll take you on <laughs> all that oppose me shall be put to a swift death they'll all regret ever crossing me after them none are to leave here alive hold on don't have to go that far. It's no good, son. He's not listening. That may be so, but if we don't stop him, he's going to be trouble. Dong Zhuo is a parasite who thrives on chaos. If we bring peace, he will have no place to live. So we're just supposed to wait until he burns out? Father, please tell me you're joking. You could stop him if you wanted. Wong guy, am I really of any use at all to my father? What's gotten into you? Sometimes, I just don't understand why my father hides his true strength. But unlike my brother, I don't have the courage to say my peace. And so, here I am, just watching the two of them again. I must say, I do not understand the two of them either. Unlike you, they usually don't talk to me about how they feel. I think Twan is probably the only one that feels like he can ask for your opinion. I think you underestimate just how valuable you are, right? <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. No, I didn't do anything. Fine work, my son. 
Thank you. <laughs> With the family together, there's nothing we can't overcome. Right, father? Yes. I am always so proud of your achievements. Pretty impressive, Twan. Hey! That was incredible! You're really showing me up out there, little brother. I'll have to try harder. Please, brother. That's enough. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a tease! <laughs> Enemy General Hua Xiong has fallen before me. Huh. Now there's a man that'd be worth fighting. He is magnificent. So, that is the famous Guan Yu. Come on, Father. Dong Zhu is still further ahead. You're mine! Wait! He's too much for one man! What were you thinking? Attacking on your own! We must combine our strength to defeat him! <laughs> now we stand a chance. Never should have let him go. themselves have chosen you. I mean, it has to be. What are the odds of this happening? Father? You and she will fulfill his promise now. Uh, father. Listen, I... Sir. Oh. 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 The enemy commander has been slain! Father! No! They mustn't escape! to give up the Imperial Seal. The seal means nothing by itself. 
Authority does not reside in a symbol. It comes with power. So we need to prove our strength. To reclaim our land. Yes. Let's do it, Joyu. I'll follow you. Wherever you go. Joe Yu's come through for us! He has the eyes of a warrior! My name is Tai Shu Tzu, loyal warrior of Liu Yao! Lord Sun Tzu, I request a battle with you! Yeah! Bring it on! they're fighting for. I, uh... And please, don't you say it's for Lord Sun Tzu either. It's you. Each and every one of them would gladly give their lives for you. They're giving everything they have. You're right. I have been selfish. Lian Shu, I ask that you stay by my side. If I ever lose my way again, I'll need you with me. It would be my pleasure. We have him! Calm down, Ling Tong. You mustn't lose your cool. Take it easy. There's no need to argue. How about you both take me on at once? My lord, we cannot bow before a scoundrel like Cao Cao. But we cannot hope to match the might of his army. We must surrender. Cao Cao's demand for our surrender. Liu Bei's request for an alliance. What would my father have done? Or my brother. <laughs> Surrender. Alliance. Both options are reasonable, I think. But, I have faith in Wu, faith in you all, therefore, I must think of our future. We will fight, we will join forces with Liu Bei and defeat Cao Cao. From now on, any who suggest surrender, We'll share in this desk's fate! The wind... It's blowing. It's all yours, Huang Guy. I have served you all, Lord Sun Jian. Lord Sun Tzu, and now, you, my lord. <laughs> now we're cooking. We 
Behold! This is the burning desire of the three leaders of the Soon family! Let's get started. You're going nowhere. Lord Huang Gai. Please, I ask that you leave the pursuit of Cao Cao to us. But why? We have already put a plan into place. One guy. What happened? Uh, I'm sorry. He got away. But Zhuge Liang... He was here? Just what is that man up to? Nan Jun is now under our control. Next, we must look to Xiang Yang. My lord, Xiang Yang has fallen to Guan Yu. What? Ugh. Zhuge Liang. He's always one step ahead. Ugh. You told us all it was a lie that you were injured. I... I thought I could hold out until we had Xiong Yang. Hey, pull yourself together! I never dreamed that you and I would end up like this. <laughs> well, I always had a feeling that we might. Farewell, my lady. Lian Shur, thank you for everything. I wanted to take you with me. But I know that there is someone here who needs you even more than I. <laughs> take good care of my brother. This marriage will be as a chain upon Liu Bei. It will prevent him from attacking Wu. My sister seems happy. Even though she is being used as a pawn. As a leader of men, you have a long way to go to match your father's legacy. And your ambition pales beside that of your brother. I know. <clears throat> and therein lies your strength. Your awareness of your own weakness means you have to put considered plans in place to win. You may be weak, cowardly, and devious, but in the end, that is why you will be victorious. Your words mean the world to me. I will not forget. Hmm. And I have done all I have to. Not yet! Not yet! Zhou Yu!
I reckon this m You too. You never stop. With Lord Joe you gone, we must be more united than ever to support our Lord. Yeah, yeah but, but he was... was... Hey, how about a contest? Who begs the most enemies? And the loser has to leave the army. Huh! Sounds lame. But... It'll get you to shut up for a while. No! <laughs> I'm Zhang Liao. It's Zhang Liao! It's really him! The mighty Zhang Liao, huh? Ha! Let's see how mighty he really is! What are you waiting for? Retreat! Retreat! Hey there. Gan Ning. You remember how many you beat? Huh? You're not still doing that, are you? How about we start again from scratch? New stakes. The loser buys the winner drinks for a year. Huh. Sounds good to me. All right. Not again. Maybe next time. You wish to fight me with that frail body? I might have known. You'd see. You're right. I am suffering from an illness. Now that you know that, you'll know. I have absolutely nothing to lose. Your spirit remains strong. You deserve the honor of the absolute best I have to give. My lord! Why would you fight when you were clearly so ill? <laughs> Jing province is ours at long last. And Lord Zhou Yu's dream is fulfilled. My lord, your time begins now. Your talents must support the future of Wu. Army is large. Army is large in number, but they have marched a long way. We must strike now, while they are still fatigued. Absolutely. So everyone is in favor of Ling Tong's plan. Just a moment. Lord Ling Tong's plan has merit. But it fails to consider the emotions. Who do you think you are? I don't believe a word he's saying. That's he's nonsense. out of his mind! Come on. Having lost Guan Yu, the Shu army is burning for revenge. We should shore up our defenses and wait for the enemy to realize their own fatigue. Hmm. It's not half bad. Can we really hold out against an army that size? You doubt us? Remember, we have used cunning to defeat large armies before. At Cherbi, for example. Right on! Yeah! Lu Xuan, 
You will take command in this battle. Leave this to us. You go after Liu Bei. It's about time I got to have some real fun. We'll take care of this. Very well. I am in your debt. No threat to Wu to Wu anymore. Please. No. I must avenge my fallen brother. Or die trying. That would be foolish. Sun Chuan. Lower your weapon, Lu Xuan. Shu has been destroyed. They have not the means to oppose us anymore. Or maybe they do. Maybe I just don't want to bring any more pain to my sister. Brother. Thank you. My father and brother and brother were alive. I used to resent the fact that all I was good for was watching them. But not everyone can do that. It is your talent. Yes. My sister and Zhou Yu said the same thing. I have come to realize that it is not so bad. With your help, we have been able to keep Wu safe. My lord, you must never forget that it is your wisdom and vision that has kept us all safe. It's very kind of you to say so. My lord, preparations are complete. We await your orders. Listen, man! We defeated the forces of Shu at Yi Ling. Now we must defeat Wei and prove we are the mightiest of the Three Kingdoms. That is the only way to bring peace to Wu and happiness to my people. Fight, soldiers of Wu, for our kingdom and for our families. Forward to glory! I thought this was man to man. I am a ruler, Zhang Liao. Hmm, I see. Well, I am a warrior. I cannot simply withdraw! <laughs> Fight. Excellent. It shames me to lose to a flip flopping turncoat like you. The Wu have always prioritized the safety and happiness of our people. Now that we are the mightiest of the Three Kingdoms, this war is over. You wish me to live on in shame? You are a leader, Cao Pi. You have supporters, and people who need your guidance. You must not leave them. Five. 
Fine work, son. Yeah, I knew you had it in you, Twan. In the end, it is you who will be victorious. But I... I don't... I'm a... This peace is but a mere dream. If only the war were over, for good. My lord, what are... <laughs> Everyone! Let us enjoy this! <laughs>